because it's Sarah and guess what I have? I have the Planner Society box and I'm so excited. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it up and pull everything out. So I can show it to you. So first we have this little pencil bag here because I remember seeing the preview because I'm one of those that can't wait to see what I'm going to get. I'm like excited, but I love the flowers. They're so pretty, but you can fit like pens and scissors and different things in here. And then you've got like little pen holders here and then you can fit some other things, maybe stickers or more pens or whatever it is you want to do there. And then we have the bag full of goodies. And I did go ahead and peel that back just so that it would be a little bit faster as far as getting everything done and there's so much stuff in here i love the springy flowers and all that kind of stuff that she did for this one so i'm just going to kind of move everything over to the side and get started first let's start with the washi we have that matches all of the kit i love how she has everything matching it's so cute and then we have these cute little palm planner clips right here. I'm not going to take them off the little card, but I did want to pull them out so you can see them a little bit better. So we have this gray one with like a little uh, pink charm. I think they're all the pink charm. And then we have this like yellow one and we have this striped rose one here, which is really pretty as well. So really like that. And then we have this stamp here, which I'm excited about, but I'm also nervous about because y'all, I'm, I'm not a stamp I've tried them and I did not do very well. So I'm not going to, well, I, get, I will. I'll open it up. I was gonna say, I'm not going to take this out. But then I looked at it and I was like, well. Okay, so then we have the post-its right here that are the little flower pot that are really cute. And I'm trying to put everything back in that way. Like I don't mix up bags and then don't know what to go with what. So I probably need to go ahead and put this one back in as well y'all I love these palms they're so cute and I've been looking at getting palms I just haven't done it yet because every time I see any that are like on sale or anything I'm broke at the time so uh, these are the ones that she normally does the little tabs which apparently my bag is a little open on the side but I'm still gonna let's see try to open it from here because it doesn't feel like it's loose enough that it would be there we go okay so we have all the little tabs and the little like labels to put on them and then we have let's see the I'm just going to kind of show you what uh, papers they are so we have this kind of uh, chevron white and yellow we have another of the gray another chevron white and yellow then we have some more gray with some like little pink flowers then we have a pink background right here and we have more of the gray we have another pink background we have a pink background with the black and then we have a yellow background and we have another one with smaller print on it and some more yellow right here so hopefully i showed that well quite a bit there and i need to actually start using those and i've got um what do you call it undo which i could do in order to uh which i forgot to put this little thing back in here um i've got undo so i could always take them off every month and that's i think the reason that i haven't done it is mostly because I don't want to mess up any of my inserts, but I want everything to match. But I really like when I see those tabs and being able to see them from the outside. So I don't know. I need to figure it out. And I know in this one there's tons of die cuts. We have these little uh, kind of wood looking cutouts to put on like your little planner covers or anything like that so i love that it has planner lists girl so it could be planner girl list hello noted to do today love plan and beautiful all right there and i'm not going to take those out of the package oh and this pen has the big huge cute or beautiful diamond on the top of it or faux diamond but anyway so then it kind of matches the papers as well and opens up i've seen a lot of those pens i know they're kind of 
popular right now. And then y'all, this, I saw this in the preview and I almost died. Like, I think this is the cutest thing and I want like a million of these. So anyway, it's just a little folder, but you have this one here with a little cutout there, which is really cute, trying to kind of move that so you can see it. And then you have the cutout on this one as well and it opens up more like that to put like stickers or something in or bills or whatever. And then this one kind of got a side flap and it flaps over like that. So you can still kind of see what you have in them, but uh, you kind of have a little bit more privacy like if somebody else is looking through or anything like that, or you, you just have some more pretty. So, and don't we all want a little bit more pretty? I mean, that's what planner girls kind of are all after, right? Anyway, so we have that. And then we have, I'm going to go ahead and do the stickers. I'm going to do the die cuts last. So I should have opened that one up. I didn't go all the way in though. So, all right. So this is the stickers right here. I've thought about ordering the sticker kits that go with these. I just haven't. So we have this sheet right here. We've got some little teacups, some little uh, three-tier platters, some extra little platters. We've got a bookcase there, some more teacups, bird cage, and flowers. We have some girl with some flowers. And then we have hat, the little um, jar with our vase. And then we have some hanging gardening stuff there and some books and some of the vases and chair. And that is, yeah, pretty much everything right there. So absolutely gorgeous stickers. Can't wait to start playing with them. Which the other kits that I've gotten, I haven't done those yet either, but it's fine. And we'll stick those back in there. Trying to keep everything together. All right, so now we've got some huge die cuts and some little die cuts. So we have this one with the little vase and the little drinks next to it on the little wooden looking tray. And I'm, gonna, I'm trying to make sure, because I always end up with not enough space. So then we have the little teacup with a little rose on it. And then we have the little three tier trays right here with little birds and flowers and kind of looks like a makeup bag or something. Then we have the little vase right here or water pot with flowers in it. And then we have the hanging gardening clothes and hats and everything. And then we have some books with some flowers. And then I'm actually gonna, there we go. And then we have a little flower pot and we have the bird cage. We have a girl with flowers. And then we have a little bookcase right here with some flowers on it. Drying flowers, oh that's cute. And then we have another girl. And then we have some more flowers. And then we have a chair with some flowers. Oh, there we go. Then we have a hat with some flowers. And then we have another girl with some flowers. And then we have some of the cards. So this one says, find beauty in the little things. This one says, just start. I love that. Then we have, do all the things with kindness, all things with kindness. Then we have, don't forget to be awesome. I love how they're little tags. Uh, today was a good day and planner girl. Those are so cute, guys, y'all. Really cute. So we have all of those and put them all back together and back in their little pouch so I don't lose anything. And that was from one of the little tags. I feel like I'm playing cards right here almost. I know that's not what I'm doing, but that's how I felt for a second there. Anyway, we all know I'm kind of crazy. So I'm going to stick this back in here. I love how springy it is and March is the beginning of spring. And then we have the big die cuts right here. 
which I'm excited about. I love the big ones. So we have the big stack of books. We have a big stack of teacups. We have a big stack of bows, which I may be about to lose my camera here. Another big stack of teacups. A bigger stack of books. <laughs> a bigger stack of teacups. A bigger stack of bows and a bigger stack of teacups right here as well. So that is all of the die cuts. I love how they just get bigger. More card playing. Okay, I'm pretty sure my battery is about to die. Okay, so now we have, if the shot's a little different, it is because I had to cut it off to change the battery. And now we have the papers which I don't like. They don't have a little flip over, but I got it. It'll be okay. That's just me being picky. There we go. I like to keep it kind of towards the top so I can protect as much of the paper as possible because she has beautiful, beautiful papers. So first we have this gray one with all the flowers on it. And then on the back side of that, we have the pink with the black flower drawing. Y'all, this rose one just uh, gives me life. I love it. And then we have the yellow on the back side with some rose. And then we have some gray right here. And on the back side of that, we have the yellow with the chevron or chevron yellow. And then we have our vellum right here. And we have our acetate, which is absolutely gorgeous. And then we have more acetate right here. And that is everything. So that way you get to see all of that. And then this is all of the extras that came with it as well, or all the little add-ons. So we have the washi, we have that, and we have the beautiful, um, pencil case as well. So all of that is absolutely gorgeous. I love this month's uh, Planner Society box. So definitely go and check her out. If you haven't already subscribed, subscribe down below and give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, which I definitely hope you did. And like I said, go and check out the Planner Society. All of her stuff is absolutely gorgeous. I love, love, love this box. So anyway, talk to y'all soon. Bye guys.